Yo, what's poppin'? It's your boy from the C, the ATL Don, checking in, and you're watching Fitted Fiend. Cause my sweat turned off right now. Get friend loose, going to turn off. Talk that talk, but it ain't about much. Hey, no mess, cause the sweat turned off. This week on Fitted Fiend, we have pickups from the Rome Emperor's team store. With no further ado, let's get into this. All right, so if you're a follower of minor league baseball, you should know by now the Rome Braves, which I'm representing here, are no longer going by that name. They, back in November, uh, unveiled a new name. They now go by the Rome Emperors. So their um, season opener slash home opener is April 5th. This coming up Friday. So I want to knock this out before then because there's some of the stuff that I picked up I, I want to wear to the game. So before we get into these, I guess you'd say unbaggings, since uh, I went to the store and actually picked it up, so I won't be unboxing anything, uh, make sure you go join our Facebook Fitted group, also called Fitted Fiend, New Era 5950 Community. Links in the description or go to fittedfiend.com to help you find it easier. 2,400 members strong. Thanks for the love and support. Post your fitters of the day. Buy, sell, trade. Help assist members get fitters that may not be available in the area. Uh, I've lost track of how many countries um, are that we have members in, but it's a great group of men and women. Go check it out. Make sure you smash that thanks button to donate to the channel. Every little bit helps. All right, so these are multiple pickups I've picked up since their name unveiling because ever since they revealed their new name, they have nothing left with the Rome Braves name on it. I do have one more Rome Braves video I do need to film of my final haul, but I keep pushing it to the back burner. And it's a pretty massive haul, so I keep telling myself I'm going to do it, but I haven't got around to it yet. All right, so uh, let's check out. Let's see. Let me find one that has some fitteds in it to start off with. All right, so this one, on the name unveiling night, I picked up their row jersey that said Rome with their Rome fitted hat um, for that goes that particular jersey. I originally, and I still favor their road jersey and road hat over their home one, but um, the home one has grown on me the more I've seen it. So I wanted to go ahead and get that. Plus, they're changing the minor league logo on the back of the hats and the jerseys. So I wanted to snatch these up before. They switched to the new style logo. Some of their merch is already coming in with the new style minor league logo on it. So uh, initially, their fitted sold out in the first four days of them releasing them. So I had to wait for a restock because I you know, only once I once again, like I said, I only picked up the their road hat. So I finally got their home hat. So once again, they're now called the Rome Emperors formerly Rome Braves. Some people aren't thrilled with the name. Some people like it. They have a penguin. I think they just unveiled his name yesterday. I think they're calling him Julius the Penguin. So uh, you got him dressed as like an emperor. All black dome and bill has the penguin logo done in black, white, red, and gold accents. Got a white new era flag on the left side. Has the MILB logo done in red, white, and navy on the back. Once again, this will be the final year of them using this logo. I imagine their next batch of hats will have the newer style minor league logo. I was expecting this batch too. And when I saw that it had the, um, the, the one that they've always used, I went ahead and snatched it up because I wanted to. So when I saw it had this on it, I knew I had to get the jersey too. <laughs> this is how I am. Uh, nothing on the right side. Black UV. These are made in Bangladesh, so I have to get a size bigger than I normally would get. So I had to get 778, New Era, official minor league tagging. So I traditionally wear 734. So if you watch the videos about me nagging about Bangladesh made, and they just don't fit right. I even picked my uncle up one, and he traditionally wears a 7.5, and, and it wouldn't even go on his head. So I actually had to, had to take it back and do a size swap and him 758s just so um, it would fit them. So their sizing is terrible on the Bangladesh made ones. So so I uh, I don't know if everyone experiences that, but uh, I personally and my uncle both had, had to go a size up to, to get the right fit. 
My issue with if I buy my 734 on Bangladesh, the dome isn't as deep, so it doesn't go down on my head as far, and it just doesn't look right. So um, that's why I go a size up. But on his particular situation, they wouldn't even like really go down on his head, so he had to, you know, go the size up uh, because of that issue. All right, so I picked up their home jersey. So their uh, road jersey that I picked up, if you want to go check out the name unveiling video, it's done in gray and has Rome across it. So the home jersey's white, got emperors done in black, outlining metallic gold accents. You see like the concrete, um, I don't know if you say columns on the E and the S on emperors. Very nice. It's made by OT Sports. I got size 46, which is, uh, so they have size 46 and size 48, and those are both considered XL, but this is on the smaller side of the XL. I've, I've been buying more of the 46s here lately just because I just like, like the fit. It's not as, it's not as, um, as loose fitting as the size 48. So, and on the sleeves, it's got, uh, the gold and black. I can't remember the proper name for that design. I know like Versace and stuff uses that same design on their stuff. Then it has OT Sports on the left sleeve. On the right sleeve has the Atlanta Braves A done in red to show that they're an Atlanta Braves affiliate. In the past they didn't have to do that because they were called the Braves so you automatically knew. Then it's got the MILB Batman logo done in gold, black, and white. Very nice. Uh, do not know yet if they're going to be putting last names on the back of their jerseys or not, like they did on the uh, their Braves jerseys. So uh, once I find that out, I'll get the proper numbering and stuff and get that customized. All right, we'll grab another one that has the fitteds and leave the ones that's just apparel for last. All right, so I did a double up of the road hat which I was previously speaking of that was on my first Rome Emperor's video so I I favor this one over this one but red is also my favorite color as well so this was the one I originally bought on the name unveiling night along with the road jersey I don't have it in here to show you what that one looks like so red dome black bill black button black eyelets has the penguins um, in a different stance on this one so on the home hat he's holding a bat and on the r red um, road hat um, he does he's just standing in a different stance with um, and does not have the bat so got the new era logo on the left done in black as the uh, MILB logo done in red white and black very nice. You know what? I actually got that wrong on the home hat. It actually is red, white, and black on that one too. I just assumed it was navy. I just at, um, first quick glance. Nothing on the right side. Black UV, black sweatband. Once again, Bangladesh made seven seven eight new era minor league official uh, tagging. So I got this as a double up just because I know they'll be changing the. Minor League logo. Just want to have one on ice because I do, once again I do have the jersey that goes with this one, and I went ahead and doubled up on the home hat once again because I have the jersey. So we just showed you that hat, so we don't need to go over that one again. All right, got a couple shirts in this one. All right, this is their batting practice shirt. I actually had to take it back and do a size swap. I traditionally wear size XL. But it was like super long, and uh, I just didn't like the way it fit, so I went back and swapped it for it. So this once again is our batting pr practice shirt. So it has the same logo as the home hat with a penguin holding the bat, with the OT Sports up above it. So the logo is done in the gold, the white, and the red. And uh, it's not like the I don't know if you call it like a. Uh, Kind of like that workout material, like on the um, compression tops, 
that you see people wear in the gym. It's not it's not like that type of material, but it is thin. This does have the new style Meyer Lee logo on the back, done in gold, white, and black with the four stars. So I was expecting that the restock of their fit is to have this logo, but I'm happy it didn't. So uh, that's why I went ahead and doubled up on um, both the home and the road hat and went ahead and got the home jersey. You know, since it still had the old logo on it. So this is my first piece with the updated minor league logo on it. I wish they didn't change it. For those that don't know, the one they've used for years is actually the silhouette of Jackie Robinson. So I'm shocked that they got away from that. So I got this BP shirt. Might actually wear this on opening day depending on the temperature. So I had a shirt like this back when there were the Rome Braves back in like 2008. I still have it. I just have to find it. So it says the road to the show. And uh, this is minor league baseball on the left chest. It's printed on a gilded blank. Then on the back it has road to the show with all their minor league affiliates. The one I have from 2008, the minor league affiliates were a little bit different. So it has road to the show. has the Braves up here since that's the major league affiliate. Has the Augusta Green Jackets over here since that's their single A affiliate. Then they have Rome Emperors since it's the Advanced A affiliate. The Mississippi Braves, which is the last year them playing in Mississippi, so this shirt will be out of date after this year. Um, then they have the Gwinnett Stripers, formerly known as the Gwinnett Braves, the Triple A affiliate. So um, in the past, Rome used to be the Low A. Then it's then it got bumped up to being an advanced day. Then we acquired the Augusta Green Jackets, which these teams are all leased. The Braves used to own all their minor league teams up until a couple years ago, and they sold them. That's why you're seeing a lot of these name changes because they have to pay the royalty to use the Braves name, so they're trying to get away from that because of merchandising purposes and stuff. They have to share royalties and all that good stuff. So wanted to get that. Just update a version of one I have from a long time ago. All right, this looks similar to the road jersey, as in this is how Rome is done on the front of the road jersey. It's just done in Heather Gray. Once again, gold, black, and red coloring on everything. So wanted to get that. It's also printed on Gildan Blank. Got it size XL. And last but not least, I picked up this red shirt that has the Emperor's logo on it. The same logo they use on the road hat. Very nice, done in the black, gold, and white. Once again, size XL. Once again, on a Gildan T. So. That's all my Rome Emperor's merch. I just wanted to knock this out before their opening day so I could pick something out of this to wear for it. So, might wear the Rome Emperor's home jersey with the home hat, possibly. I haven't decided yet. So, but uh, happy I was able to double up on this one um, and end up getting two of these so I can have one on ice. Comment down below. Let me know what all you like from my pickups. Uh, have you picked up anything from the Rome Emperors? Their stuff was selling like crazy when they first dropped, but it's, it's calmed down a little bit. But I imagine opening day, there's probably going to be nuts in their team store. They're probably going to sell a ton of stuff. Shout out to Colin, who runs the team store. And uh, he's a great guy. So go by there, check them out if you haven't already. It's my favorite minor league stadium of all the minor league stadiums I've been to. I haven't been to a ton. I've been to a handful, but it's definitely my favorite. That's also where I fell back in love with baseball in 2008 when I got back into it. It was, at, it was going to the Rome Braves before I got back into watching Major League Ball. Uh, Jason Hayward and Freddie Freeman were on that team. So uh, Rome's always held a special place in my heart. So uh, don't forget to stay to the, tune to the end of the video to see close-ups of the fitteds. 
Make sure you go join our Facebook Fitted group once again, also called Fitted Fiend, New Era 5950 Community. Links in the description or go to fittedfiend.com to help you find it easier. Smash that thanks button to donate to the channel. Please give a big thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe down below if you haven't already. Trends and limited merch in the description. Until next time, it's your boy from the C, the ATL Don, signing out. Peace.